Hello everyone, Alien Volt here, and I am playing World of Warcraft. And this is the pre-release of Warlords of Draenor. And I'm going to go over the level 100 talents for Feral Guardian spec. And Feral Guardian is tanking, if you're not aware of that. <sighs> Alright, you'll notice one of the things they did was they, uh, they freed up, according to them, your, uh, your damage bars. They took some of the abilities, you know, kind of mashed them together, supposedly freed up our abilities. As you'll notice here in bear form, um, I still pretty much have most of the abilities I had before. The only exception was was when I was in cat form, as you notice, I only had three abilities. One AoE, one damage attack, and one finishing move. Um, in bear form, I pretty much have most of the abilities I had previously. Now the first talent we're going to talk about here is Guardian of Elune. And what Guardian of Elune does is it basically cuts your Savage Defense down to 3 seconds from 6, but it increases the actual chance to dodge from 50 to 100. So it's pretty decent. I mean it gives you a 100% chance to dodge. You're not going to die if you hit it, but it only lasts for 3 seconds versus 6. But another thing that it does is that it actually um, reduces the time of your cooldown to use that ability by your percentage to dodge. So if your percentage to dodge is say 25%, it's actually going to reduce your time from two minutes to a minute and a half, so you can use it every minute and a half. Which is not bad. Alright, the next ability is Pulverize. And Pulverize is described as a devastating blow that consumes three stacks of your Lacerate on a target, dealing 4100 physical damage. And then on top of that, it reduces damage taken, so increasing your passive defenses by 15% for 12 seconds. So, you've got an ability that basically consumes your bleed, your Sunder Armor type of a, a threat builder on a target, does a burst damage, and then buffs your defensive abilities for 12 seconds by 15 percent. That's not bad. Of course it would be much better if it was a complete passive ability that caused your lacerate to explode with damage upon finishing up its uh, duration and then also giving the passive ability a 15 percent um, damage reduction, but it's not going to do that. I'm sure they'll come up with plenty of mods that actually uh, make that very useful. Alright, the last ability is Bristling Fur, which reduces all damage taken by 40% for 3 seconds. So not bad. Not bad at all. Um, and the cooldown's a minute. But you could actually macro that with Savage Defenses, use that as the actual move, and you can activate this every minute, every 2 minutes, you'll be activating both, so getting a 90% damage reduction every two minutes, which would um, almost make it as good as Guardian of Loon. but you'd be getting the extra 40% in between. So if that makes any sense, you could use this every minute, and then every two minutes upon activation, you'd be getting 90% versus 40%. So not bad at all. Um, that may actually be the way to go, just because you'll be able to activate it every minute versus every minute and a half, say, with the other um, Guardian of Alert. Alright, so which talent do you want to choose? Personally, I think I'll be using Bristling Fur, uh, so long as it does uh, macro with Savage Defenses. If not, then I'll probably end up going Guardian of Alert. But I think that about does it. Anyways, that's going to end this video. I hope you like it. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and leave a thumbs up if you haven't already done so, and I'll see you next time.